All right, we're in week three of our Minnesota Vikings online user franchise, and things have not really gone super, super well as we are finding ourselves at 0-2, scoring maybe one offensive touchdown in those two weeks. New quarterback is going to be Mr. Tyree Jackson. Now, I will probably just fall down on the sword, admit I was wrong, and use Kirk Cousins if we struggle. The problem I feel is, though... It's not the quarterbacks. I feel like a lot of it is the me. Of course, the sliders, we still have the pass coverage a bit high. Same with the reaction time. So nothing is certain until, in my opinion, assuming we change them again week four. But hoping Tyree Jackson with his 60 overall self, of course, can uh, do some things. His throw power is one of the most important things in the game. He's also massively in size, of course. Average sense of pressure is a bit surprising, to be honest. One thing I do worry about, though, is that injury. Salmon is not great either. Uh, and while our injuries have been a problem, we have lowered them down quite a bit, I believe. So maybe that won't be an issue. But yeah, I wanted Mon to work out, but not a great game last week. Do we maybe give Mon another chance? I kind of want to give Mon another chance. But Tyree, Tyree played better. I, I got to start him. But Jefferson, uh, you know, had some catches finally. Thielen had a pretty decent game. So did Rager. We, of course, lost Irv Smith for another four weeks, which is great because now we have to start a 61 overall tight end. Things have gone about as perfectly as you could ask for, obviously. Kendricks has an upgrade point, but he's on a long-term contract, so I can't just get rid of him. So the best thing for me to do, in my opinion, is hold on to the upgrade points so when he does regress, we at least have, you know, kind of a plan to reboost him up by the time the season, you know, once the season's over. We got to win a game, though. The, the team is in a bad way, and it's going to get worse, especially with morale, if we keep losing. It's tough, though. It's a user league, and once again, we're still getting those sliders uh, set, and I'm using quarterbacks that suck. So that's uh, always a great sign. Obviously, Jackson here with the Lions has had himself a pretty good time of it. I'm actually going to take a look at his stats just to see. Complete, I believe he's starting Tyler Huntley. He made a trade for him. I can't remember what he gave up. Maybe a fourth-round pick. Um, numbers aren't crazy great. See, that's the thing, though. Like, I feel like I'm doing really poorly, and then you look at other numbers from other teams. You know, he was beaten up on other teams, and yet his numbers aren't great either, you know? So, I'm just saying. I'm going to give Mon one more chance. If he sucks early, I'm going to put Tyree in. I don't care. If he sucks early, that's all I can tell you. And honestly, uh, other than checking his injury report, I think it's time to go, which is just Milton Williams. Also, uh, Daniel Hunter is back, so that could be some fun. Here we are back at home hosting the Detroit Lions, a team that, of course, even previous years, at least last year, has shown a lot of promise and a lot of heart. And I'm not trying to say that I'm trying to stomp out their hearts, but at the same time, I don't want them to have some motivation, even though we're 0-2. Beating us, especially a division rival in general, would kind of give them that motivation. Of course, not a bad little return there. Doesn't get to the 25, but was pretty much like one play away, one juke move away, if you will, from breaking that free, really. And of course, kind of coming off the left side here as it could be a run. Let's bring Harrison Smith down, and it's a read option. And Huntley is a pretty fast guy. And Huntley's going to find some room to the outside and run out of bounds. And they're going to call a late hit, which is brutal. Let's bring Harrison Smith up. Let's actually let him play. Outside and nice hit. Second and eight from the 21-yard line. Pretty good coverage and a throwaway still in the pocket. Nice push. That's kind of on us. Dantzler's not going to get out there because he is really slow. Go with Patrick Peterson. And Harrison Smith, of course, gets mossed. Of course. Every time I go for an aggressive catch, it's picked. We're actually going to run this play base. I kind of like this. He's going to leave the tight end wide open. Nice gain of about eight right over the middle. Sucks that we don't have, uh, you know, the boy, if you will. He's not really even the boy, but Irv Smith, a guy that I feel like has plenty of potential. We just got to, you know, cook with him, really. Got a couple of players down here and... And we're going to cut that back nicely, but somehow Rodriguez is going to get in there, which makes no sense to me, but he does. He did have five D linemen, so maybe he got uh, a little lucky with that. Davidson streaking. Cook is probably my main look. We'll see. And he is. That guy, what a catch by Cook, but that guy somehow baited the hell out of me. I didn't even see him. I thought uh, he was going to follow whoever was streaking. I think it was Thielen. 
Great catch by Cook, though. Extends the drive, which is really important, obviously. And that is a pretty good throw, and his guy jumps in front. He was literally beat, and then he teleports right at the point for the swap. That is brutal. It is what it is. Really good throw by Tyree. And there goes Thielen. Nice throw. Went for the possession, was falling down, and was suctioned back to life, unfortunately. Nice throw. Nice catch, though. 26 yards. Jefferson's a tough one, but if we can get the blocks... And don't catch that, Muse. Damn it. A little bit of pressure. Wasn't going to be able to get that deep. And one of my other reads there was actually Jefferson. And sadly, Jefferson kind of got locked up. Actually, let's run this base. And there we go. And Thielen. Of course, another one. That's literally a bailout. And we're going to get just about the first down. We can go for it here without having to waste any, like, go-fors or anything. We could just, you know, could just do it. Got to give it to Tyree, though. Tyree is actually playing pretty well here. And we couldn't get it out there. It's a good stop by him. And there goes Asamoa on the mid blitz. A loss of three. Not bad. User Bolden. And that should be picked. It is Booth. Holy Sewell. What a move. Touchdown. Andrew Booth, the rookie, with a pick six. I'm just glad they didn't call the freaking P.I., dude, because it was kind of P.I. I jumped it, but the ball didn't go there, so they're going to, you know, they could have called P.I. there. Hawkinson, a little bit of a bad throw from Tyler Huntley. Not really sure why these throws are so bad. Tyler Huntley's worse than uh, our guy, but doesn't seem like it so far. I'll tell you what. To the outside, that is Daniil Hunter. There's no way he's covering Jamison Williams, but I'm trying to mix up the coverages a little bit. And we kind of got locked up. Dalvin, get in there. Second and one. That's a pretty big run considering we brought five players down, but I guess that's what happens. At least the game's back to equal. Obviously, uh, you know, we failed our conversion on fourth down. He threw a pick six. It is what it is. He hands it off inside. It could have been a face mask. It sure as hell looked like one. It's going to gain some yards. We were, uh, you know, containing the edge, and we did a good job with that. But at the same time, we didn't get back inside. And because of that, he actually had a play. This is not good for us at all. Throws it underneath. I mean, look at how fast he is. Like, that is a bad juke move, and yet I still couldn't catch up. Like, he re, -re gathered speed. Faster than I could even run straight, dude. That's insane. Go with Dantzler. I actually do like that play action. We left that wide open to the running back. But then again, in general, running backs are really hard to cover. He really has nowhere to go, and he's going to get sacked. Hunter gets his... Uh, or Zade uh, Zadarius. I don't know who Zadarius is. Zadarius gets his sack stolen. It sucks to be a man. <laughs> and... Uh, Either way, it's still a sack. We'll take it. End of the first quarter. Playing a little bit better this game than we did the last two games. And we see ourselves in a good opportunity to try and stop him from scoring a touchdown. But obviously looking good and actually playing it are two different things, sadly. And that should be picked. Oh, my God. Bailed out again. Like, how? How are we not picking that? If I throw any of these, it's picked. And here goes Nwangwu. Decent little return of the 22. Similar to his guy earlier. Bring them out a little bit. Run play up the middle. Going to cut it back left. Had tons of room. He's not going to use her, that guy, which smartly, because Dalvin Cook's a tough guy to bring down one-on-one. -on -one. Hand off inside. And we get some pretty good blocks. Dalvin fighting. Gains about eight out routes. Let's see what we got with Jefferson streaking, maybe. Yeah, that's my fault. Try to go for the free form. Ran this play earlier. Patriots drag. Kind of got bailed out with a throw to the running back. Might have to pay attention to that route to Thielen because last time it actually got open. In motion. Could be looking for Rager, actually. He would be a decent little look. And that is a really good throw. Clutched up on third and three. 
Seen Thielen had the one-on-one -on -one look, but the coverage was pretty much locked down, so was forced out of it, and we took the drag. Double drag, speaking of. Let's go to curl route with Jefferson. I don't know what that'll do, but... Quick throw to Rager. Five-yarder. I want to run this to Thielen, dude. Let's actually run this the drag with Thielen. And that is right in behind him. And that's a good fight by Thielen down to the 28. Could be looking for Thielen a little bit deeper here. And there goes Thielen again. Nice fight to the eight. Big hit. Ty Chandler backup carries a little predictable. Aiden Hutchinson actually getting a push there. A little late though. And he dove early. Ty Chandler bounces it in. Touchdown. Not bad. He sold on that when he jumped early at the ground and he took advantage by just running straight. Really good blocks on the inside though. Love that. You know, we commit to what was working more in that drive than normal. You know, we hit a couple of drags, a couple of short throws, but we were able to still hit some deep shots, too. A couple 10, 15 yarders. It worked out. Awesome. Moa, bring the line left. This is a tough one for us. He has that quick throw, but he didn't decide to take it. And it's overthrown. If that was on target, that would have been a catch. If the ball would have been on target from where that was thrown right there, it would have probably been picked. But it should have, uh, it should have been there. That's my fault. Picked! I baited it. I didn't even mean to bait it. I actually just straight up sold. What a pick. Peterson with the hands. I want to go play action, but our tight end does not have that kind of... Ooh, Dalvin, do not hurdle into a hit stick. Does not have that kind of route running. And... All right, I really want to run the, the pass play, but I like the, the inside handoff. Dalvin finding some room. Dalvin to the 13-yard line. Dalvin with a stretch play now. I mean, we're playing a little scared. Is that a linebacker on him? Could hit Thielen. Nah, don't fumble. Good, good job, Tyree. Hutchinson gets a sack. I know he'll love that one. Doesn't really do much for us or him, but goes on the stat sheet as a sack, so. It's a good try, at least, I suppose. It's a lot of players. This looks like perfect coverage, to be honest. And that's a dot! Oh my god, how? That linebacker is causing me so many issues here. It's pain. Oh, that sucks. We threw it behind him, but... Oh, that sucks. Get out there. That interception's more on us than anyone, so it is, it is what it is. And there goes Daniel Hunter, Zedarius... Getting his half back. Not really his to, you know, have. So, what can you really say? Let's contain. Oh, Harrison! You bot! It was a decent route, but, like, really, dude? He has played, like, trash this game. Harrison's normally my guy, but he has played bad today. Like, he has been really bad. And good job. Enough by Bolden to bring down Huntley. Quick throw to the outside, almost killed Lewisine. Considering the situation we're in there with like, you know, the the down and distance, I'm actually pretty glad that that's what he went with. Perfect coverage by us. I knew that's what he wanted pre-snap and I will have to call a timeout here. To be looking for a quick throw to the running back and he does. Good ta well, it wasn't a good tackle. Nice hit stick, though. We're going to run mid, but we're going to pull off Asamoah. And there you go, Zadarius. Brought five. Ooh, Nwangwu tried. He had a chance. He had a chance of that side a little bit. Just get a block. Kind of want to just be forced to make a read here. And that's a hold on Hutchinson, so we're going to just throw it away. You'd see that coming pretty easily there. This guy was, like, fighting us. <laughs> you could see him fighting. He was, like, punching. We do have one timeout, but I'd prefer not to use it on a random freaking run call. And there goes Davidson. Gets knocked out of bounds for a gain of five. It's not really much, but his punter has a bruised sternum. 
his punter is injured. Rager, he does have some speed. Nah, we got sacked. Probably drop back a little bit too far. He should be the one calling timeouts here, just going to be honest. And we'll take that 14 all at half. I don't know who gets the ball first. It might be him, us. Well, he got the ball first, I think, and then we get the ball now. I believe. I think. All right, the kick is off to start the second half. It's a better game than most games this week. Didn't really get help for Nwangwu. Gets not even to the 20. He knows it's a run, but I don't really care too much. Nice move by Dalvin, turning into a gain of three. Considering the blockers were like, do you really need our help? And we were like, yes. And they're like, well, you're not getting it. So, sorry. Stop and go. That's not... I don't think I clicked the right thing. Under pressure, Dalvin didn't really need him to catch that. Saw the pressure and I was like, I'm getting that out of here. I kind of want to actually keep the Muse block, but we're not going to. And there goes Dalvin. Perfect throw. And wow, that was really bullcrap because he had room to run. A fade stop? What is it? I don't like that. Post is cool, but that's like kind of it. Throw it away. He was close. If he would have dove, he might have had us. Play action look. Jefferson. And he misses him. Oh my god. That is an ultra bail. I know our guy sucks, but that is... Like, that is, like, the worst I've ever seen. Like, anyone in the world hits that. Like, that's just bad. Like, like everyone makes that throw in real life. And, of course, it's picked. I go for a jump ball. His guy's there. He goes for a jump ball. Caught. Simply fun. I just asked for one bail. I've been bailed against all game long. Like, yeah, can I just have one? Like, just, just one, please. That's all I asked for. Just want one like, hey, you're thrown into coverage, but your guy's 6'2". Why not? Just let him have it. Just one, please. Okay? I get it, right? The read's not great. It doesn't matter. Oh, it switched me to the wrong guy. Thank God someone else was there because I wasn't making that play. I think we ran this earlier. It didn't really work out. Dancer's not that fast to run that if that's a quick out. Last second man coverage was a really good play by us, but no pressure, unfortunately. And he's in trouble. The two superstars get him again. Block run. <laughs> Swift running left. Swift running light. Right. Not going to block anyone. And our guy PI'd him so hard. How is this guy burning us that hard? Like, that was probably a touchdown. We were running back, but there's no way we get there in time. And another one. So many bailouts. Kendrick's got that change of direction. It's going to be a throw, but what can I do? And we stopped him to the two. We really need to stop. This would be huge. Oh, he kind of got lucky. That's a pick six. I'm pretty sure if that's on target. And he fumbled the ball. I don't know why he went for that, but I suppose I sure as hell didn't see it. Up the middle, Ty Chandler finding some room. Ty Chandler finding a lot of room all the way to the 21. I'll hurry up to the line. Get my backup carries in and gain some yards. Why not? Ooh, I thought I was going to be able to outrun him to the edge. Dalvin Cook. we let him cook up. That's a really good read to know that I'm going to cut back there. Should have kept following the stretch, to be honest. Damn, they want us to just run, run, run. Do I trust in Davidson to make a play, though? Oh! Gonna use our go for here. This is risk. And that is a perfect throw while pressured. Pretty much had no choice but to use my go for there. Like, there's just no option. And that is a perfect throw to Jalen Rager. Utilizing the speed. 61-yard touchdown. Dot by Tyree. Missing the Jefferson one earlier. And giving us the lead with that throw. Beauty. Tyree Jackson is the real deal, kids. I don't care what anyone says. I used all three quarterbacks. And Tyree has felt like the best by far. Ooh, that's a nice little move. Thank God we got him. 25-yard line. 
A couple of really good kick returners, both sides, that have felt like, you know, likely scores. And we just get... That might be the best return to the 25, ironically enough. He's going to run here, I'd say. He hasn't run the ball much. Oh. And that's going to be picked by Bolden. I think he thought we were going to run after the running back. And we didn't. Things are unraveling. Oh, nice hit by Wanham. Thank God for Lewis seeing those. I ain't going to lie. Harrison Smith is really disappointing me today. That is going to be a pitch to the other side. Nice hit by Harrison. Start of the fourth quarter. Uh, surely we can't choke this, right? We got a couple of bailouts for scores. We got a couple of bails, bailouts that, uh, you know, negated scores. Our guy PI'd the hell out of uh, Hawk. I'm not sure how it wasn't called. Uh, we have PI on, too. That's a really good route, but it's late. And is that Lynch? It's Harrison Phillips. I always think it's James uh, whatever his name is, and I should know that, but I don't. And it never is. Not the user Daniel Hunter out here. I have no idea how good he is. Oh, that's a great find, but a huge hit to the knee. Running that press, man. I feel like Hawkinson over the middle is going to be the look, but we're going to do what we can. Oh, this is a tough one. Harrison one-on-one. -on -one. Now he missed hard. He sold with the slap. Man, the last second change-ups is just so brutal. Oh, what a hit. Like, just because we have it by speed doesn't mean that we should switch last second. That's a really good jump by us. And wow, what a throw by Huntley, who's missed some really bad ones today, but that was not one of them. Hunter in coverage again. I'm stuck on Sue. And that's a missed throw. Kind of saved him there maybe, though. As, I mean, Peterson's all over that, but Hawkinson's big. We got a man up against uh, number four. And I don't know if he would have fit that in there, but I was baiting it. Dantzler, who's slow as hell anyways. Is he actually blitzing? Because I don't see a blitz. I'm going to be leaving the middle wide open here. That's a really good play by, uh, by us. Six yards gain, but obviously for us to make that play is pretty impressive. Oh, and he holds on. That's tough. Made a really good play with us, user. Oh, he's got it underneath. Good tackle. Won't let him out of bounds. Good play. Why do I feel like Harrison Smith's the guy that needs the most help? He holds on all over that. Come on, Booth. Get a hand in there. Let's see, he knows it's man. Oh, what is he doing? Number Bolden just like dove at him. He was like, I'm just going to kill him. I don't care. I'm not, I'm not dealing with this anymore. Like, really? That's really good D by us. For me to get over there last second as well is pretty impressive. I mean, we got dudes like all over the place. Oh, what a hit. Fourth and six. Chance to get off the field. I kind of want to bring mid. Press it up. Hope for the best. Okay, I got to use our scene instead of... Okay, I can get over to Awesome Moa. No, I can't. It's all right. Picked! Thank God that was fourth down. Harrison Smith has had a bad day. Little, all you can really say is he's had a bad day. And there goes Dalvin. Nice fight to the 32. That was absurd, dude. First win of the season, it appears, though. Ty Chandler finding a lot of room. Nice little run to the 46. Maybe we need to run the ball more. Because this is kind of absurd. Block's not really looking good there. Getting pummeled. Up the middle, second and 10 from the 45. Obviously just trying to waste the clock out. Not trying to fumble, please, game. Not really trying to throw a pick here, but... Good fight. Well, not maybe a good fight, but... Good completion, I suppose. Not a great game from Tyree, but, I mean, overall, considering... It's not the worst in the world. And a safety. Uh, all right. We got a victory against Jackson as well, who's... I mean, he was 2-0. He, uh, he took on some really tough 
users. He was able to beat Lance, who won a billion Super Bowls last year. He beat Rod, who he just played and lost to pretty badly. Uh, and we were able to beat him. Uh, you know, there was a little bit of luck on both sides. I would say it's more in his favor, but, I mean, trying to count back everything, it was probably a little bit closer than, you know, you would like to admit. But the picks, at least, from uh, Tyree were not really his fault. That's the one thing that I'm happy to say about I'm pretty sure one was to uh, Thielen. That wasn't his fault. And I can't remember the other one, if I'm going to be 100% honest with you. But we'll obviously be able to take a look in a moment here. Take a look at the stats before we go, though. And Booth with a pick six. Got to love that. Of course, neither quarterback really played well. But Tyree Jackson still played well enough. There was a lot of throwaways rather than incompletions. Dalvin, we probably should have ran with more. Ty Chandler had a pretty nice game. Uh, rushing in general, stopping his guys, though, not bad. Uh, receiving, Jameson Williams had a couple of plays, especially jump balls. Uh, you know, Swift had a couple of catches. Thielen was bi uh, big. Rager was decent. And another game where Justin Jefferson doesn't catch the ball. Of course, he had that huge play. That would have been like a 60-yard touchdown. A little bit of pressure, and uh, Tyree well overthrew it. Lots of pressure, though, from the defense. Harrison Phillips with two sacks. Zadarius and Hunter with uh, five combined of course, he had a little bit of pressure, but ours was, you know, or his pressure was more like coverage-based, whereas ours was just pure dominance. It's the one thing that's nice about having this team. Of course, two pick sixes, which is pretty nice. One of them was Bubba Bolden, which was our pick six. And ultimately, we got our first dub. And the best part is the stats and the uh, game itself did not count. And I will admit to you, we played this game four times. Uh, the first three times, the first two games... It's a little bit of an ugly one between both of us, and it was a close game. The third one, I was actually up 24 to zero, and uh, it desynced again. And then this one, the stats didn't count, which is just—I mean, round of applause for EA. Of course, I'm gonna be honest. Outside of the defensive stats, not the greatest game, anyways. So I'm hoping we get some pretty crazy numbers passing-wise. Maybe help uh, Tyree Jackson and whatnot. Uh, you know, get some stats and get some you know, upgrade points. But other than that, it's still going to be a win, and that's the main thing. Regardless, going against the Saints next week, week four, I do not know how they're playing, in fairness. Uh, I think they were doing okay. Then they, they had a really good game, and they had a really bad game. Uh, two and one, so seems, uh, seems decent to me. Regardless, though, that is going to be it for this one. If you guys enjoyed, maybe leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Twitter, Jump Care, second channel, PK Plays. I'm sure I've been uploading crazy over there. And yeah, next episode will be against the Saints. So get ready for that one, and hopefully I see you then. Regardless, thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys come back for the next video. But until next video, see ya!